seen. Yep. I know. Um, so here we go. This is a brand new in the past few days. It's an acrylic cotton. It is an acrylic cotton sweater knit. Two shade choices here. This is done in a sweater poncho. So think indoor chic, but easily could play in the outerwear land. Love the kind of the border or the trim. And the shades are slate blue or black. And this is bridge sizing. So how does that work? I mean, um, like a like a like a extra small small right, yeah right I mean it's very very flexible yep um, what I love about this is that it almost doesn't matter what you have on underneath mm -hmm. the minute you put it on it's like all of a sudden you're royalty you know what I mean it's just like it adds glamour where's my private plane like that kind of vibe yep yet yeah, it's just comfortable and easy and you can see yourself just cozying up oh see what I mean yep not that you didn't look beautiful before but it's like hello and it has these little buttons that allow you to create a fully fashioned sleeve armhole, yeah. or if you want to unbutton that, um, you lose the sleeve effect, and now it's more like a drape kind of capey kind of thing. Yeah. So it goes from poncho to cape mm -hmm. <laughs> to sweater, <laughs> right. to, and I like the spectator. I mean, the black and white spectators. I think you 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 can yeah yeah. I, I little... hope you're not the one teaching Jagger how to get dressed. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little wonky. Well, based on the pigtails that she was rocking on my Instagram page, where like one was here and one was here, and Joe is like, "What are you doing, honey?" Yeah, babe, it looks like I did her hair. <laughs> and I said, "Yeah, I know." Well, let actually, her... no, no, <laughs> <laughs> it was me. Um, okay, so can we go to the yeah, girls? Because yeah, yeah. I think that to your point, I like that with is that. I where mean, you see it to life. Thanks, girl. All right, and and also calling out the pockets are um, real. Yeah. <laughs> you could put a tissue in them. You yep. could put whatever you need to. Um, it's beautiful, worn open. Mm -hmm. I, do you mind? Yes, go ahead. Um, if you button it up, it kind of just covers up sort of anything that you may want to cover up. And it's like, oh, hello. Where's my limo? It's so great. I just, I feel like it elevates everything. It does. And also a lot of times ponchos are done in stiffer, felt like, wool-like, outerwear fabric. And so they really are outerwear pieces. This, I think, is a, a different take on just basically a cardigan. Right. Or a sweater. Yeah, or, exactly. You know what I'm saying? So you can keep it on indoors. It has the sleeves. It's a soft, easy, movable sweater knit. Um, Which creates versatility. So absolutely. if you're at, a, at the movies and it's a little chilly, it's nice to have that. Or, um, you know, here at the studio, for instance, like I want to wrap myself in it at all times. It's really cold here. <laughs> but you, you, obviously I'm not going to walk around. Boo a... You live where the palm trees are. <laughs> <laughs> where is Sunny and 80? Excuse me. Uh, I'm going home. I know. The but, slate blue is great, but I mean the black is a lot of drama. So if you're, that's what, that's what I was going to say. Like if you're a drama a person, mm -hmm. I think that the spectator black and white is for you. And mm -hmm. if you're more of like an, a, a subtle person, I think that the blue tonal is probably the best option. I mean, so comfortable, so easy, so... Do you have the length on your... Yeah, I do. Um, Hold on, but I have to... So if you get the, um, like a medium large, remember it's bridge sizing, is 30 inches center back. And the XL1X is 31 inches center back. Um, so you can see it's, I mean, it's really generous. Yeah. It really, it really will cover up like all of your blouses and t-shirts or yeah, whatever the, you have underneath it. The back sweeps down so low, it hits me like mid thigh. Yeah. So, so the reason that we coverage. did that is because I wanted you to be able to wear all of your blouses and tops and then just cover everything up. And Great not with have, leggings. Yes. Because it's covering all the, and, and this is probably a really good time because we, we are not the only ones that love this. Someone very special to the, um, Lori felt <gasps> oh, brand. Yeah. Yes. Diane. Okay. Who's so, Diane? So, Di so Di we've sent this to Diane to try out in the real world. Diane is one of our heartfelt role models. And she has a really interesting story. She was a model and a musician um, in her youth in New York City. She was married to a man who was in a Broadway play. She traveled the world. And then she lost everything in Hurricane Sandy. And so she has discovered that she is going to rebuild her life. And she is rebuilding her life in the most glamorous way with her little grandson 
she inspires us so much. Look at how beautiful she is. Our heartfelt community is a closed community on Facebook. It's worth joining just to see a picture of Diane. Um, when she was a young woman living in, we have her, uh, if you want to know more about her, she's like front and center there if you join. She's a really inspirational, cool lady. It's such a great, we're going to introduce you to another um, heartfelt role model. Another heartfelt role model later in the show. I believe her name's Katie. Yes. And um, so stick around for that. And then obviously um, we have more to come in the show. 20 minutes left. Cashmere blend sweater. Oh gosh. A little acid wash jeans. Uh-huh. Acid wash jeans coming up, but very limited. This sweater that Bonnie has on. Oh gosh, look at you wearing my earrings. 